Hello ladies and gents, I am Anadiffin and this is my replay of XCOM 2. In the last mission we did a supply raid and finished upgrading everyone up to the high end weapons, so plasma and all that. Also, uh, managed to get everyone injured which was a bit of a pain, but what I'm going to do is going to take out one of these alien facilities. I'm going to take out this one. So, only nine enemies, heavy mech, shoot trooper secopod though gatekeeper and archon so yeah it might not have only nine enemies but they do have a secopod and gatekeeper one two three four five six seven eight oh so it's probably just two troopers or two lancers that's cool setting course for the western u.s precinct let's go assault the facility regardless So I don't really want three grenadiers. I think T-Rex, you're going to sit this one out. I know you're max rank, but I would like someone to heal. Not, not, not Grave Digger. I got back, back. I want Candyman. So Candyman, you're going to have the Plasma Red. Those rounds there. Top shelf. Blue screen rounds. Disrupt. So you have five bonus robotic damage. And bonus damage has is bonus damage of one. I think blue screen rounds for taking out those robotic targets. Let's make the armor available. So you are gonna have the war suit. Still gonna have the plasma grenade on you. That guaranteed guaranteed hit is always useful. Um Definitely there are other options now. Um, so things like the plated vests, all those are really good options. Addition, additional survivability, because their main weapons are pretty strong. But, for the moment, I think this will be the force. Operation Brutal Hawk, begin mission. We're moving to take out a high security advent installation operating out of this region. Intel from the resistance suggests this facility is conducting research critical to the Avatar project. Once in position, approach the designated target and plant the X4 charges. Once they're armed, move to minimum safe distance and level that facility. Sounds like a plan. Probably a couple of turrets as well. I don't think they show up on the intel. Yeah, it's always looking pretty beefy in their armor. I think I preferred the look of the previous armor. This alien armor, it's too smooth and shiny. Menace 1 5. Target coordinates are locked in. Move to designated position and place the X 4 charges. Entering squad concealment. Wechsler position. So, some of this just looks fairly similar, like this river and stuff, but the facility is different. Isn't this the. Yeah. I think this was what was you. It's very similar to this for the um, UFO invasion. I am very impressed with the whole um, random generation. On the move. On it. 
Okay, everyone went forwards. This is where the additional, um... Time to motor. Additional m movement would be very, be a nice handy ability from this war center. Location confirmed. Doing well. It was generally strong. Location confirmed. Hunker down deep cover. So we got a group over here. So that's my first group of three. Nasty, you're up. Oh, this is an interesting dilemma. Do I move and hit all three? Oh, I can hit all three here. I was going to say, do I move and hit all three? Or stay still, hit two, and then um, have salvo. But now I can hit all three, so do that. So I uncover Murphy. He generally just stays in concealment. But those guys are going to run forwards, I expect. We've been spotted. Going to see Murphy? No, they don't. Cool. Try and maybe kill that heavy mech. this location and use Dark Lance. I did not like the sound of that. Go make sure. There we go. Your existence is so I'm at a slight angle because as far as a beam. Beam. Multiple targets neutralized. Congratulations. Where's that second part? It's a bit around here. It sounds like it's coming out of one speaker, but that could just be my headphones playing up. They sometimes only have sound coming out of one side. I guess that'll be okay. You. Hunker down to get that aim bonus. Look out. And bear move up. Don't like don't like the sound of that. You hunker down. Ah, there it is. So, yeah, it, though, it, to me it sounded like it was coming out of um, the left side, but it's not the right side. Spotted flanked enemy. Not a pain. As long as you don't fire this turn, I'm happy. Lightning hands. I will shoot the psychopod momentarily. First of all, Mama Bear. Shoot the psychopod. Get hollow targeting on it. Three armor points shredded with these plasma. Very, very nice. Grade. I might do that.
Soaked pod, fire. Should last vestiges of armor from it. I'm running low on ammo. Fire lightning hands at it anyway. Nine damage because of the that makes the pistol really powerful in the hands of these guys. If you say so. Because yeah, I shoot it three times. I will shoot do a face off attack, I think. On my way. Oh no. Hello turrets. Blow that cover up. I'm sure not the one point. Face off. Um, I didn't think about the beam pistol improving the damage with the. Um... Yeah, you missed those two guys. Yeah, beam pistol very effective with that additional. Five bonus damage against robotics. Shoot the shield bearer. Bam. You want damage for your miss. Just remember, never use those to shoot codex. <laughs> Shield bear's probably gonna run there. It's gonna use shield, yes. Lance is gonna move up. Oh, he's gonna actually hit me. Ow, ow. Got two armor. Eight damage though. It's pretty intense. Ooh. Poor Razor. I would quite like to hit this guy with domination. We are of one mind. 100% chance. Beam. You are now mine. Fire the weapon at Shield Bearer. Should have shot with Mammoth Bear first. Though, that worked. Hit the armor. Here, shoot that super heavy turret. Wow. Nice. Check it before you get too close. Might try Venom Rounds as well. Massively increase your, your, your damage. Move up. Moving out. Nasty, can you see anyone? No, that guy's too. Rapid fire at that guy. Not a good chance to hit mine. That is not good. Rapid fire, come on, hit. Yes. Only the best. This might be useful. Ok, 
Okay, I... Uh, I'll put you back. But no, I'll keep you there. Moving to position. Right, just end turn. Okay, Grimly Heal on Razor. Go help them out. Probably do about eight or something now. Yeah. So I'm thinking a couple more for the tech and another one for the um the research. I want to move up. Menace one five, you're near the target position. Still not so okay. Two archons on the gatekeeper. That's not nine enemies, that's almost like miscounted. I guess that is a possibility. What's over there? Watch. Solid copy. Move up. And be careful of that gatekeeper. I'm on it. No need and to all the way watch. around. Keep everyone really spaced so the gatekeeper can't just do stupid amounts of damage. This just do a lot. Okay, Final grenade internally. Let's start shredding the armor off. Fight both of them. See a lot of armor shredded. Look at that. So much damage dealt. Got into a battle frenzy. It's fine. Boom. Oh, you missed. Shooting that. Oh, shooting over there. Plus grenade. Ow. Oh, where's that guy? Oh, this is. Oh, hey, this is corpses. That's. That's interesting. I'm just gonna slice my guy, my um guy up. That's that's cool. Another heal and razor. He's going to be gravely wounded by the end of this battle. So, run around, grab my item. Grab it for me. That has to be an XCOM soldier, okay. A 
I was hoping you'd grab it, but got to be XCOM. See a superior repeater. It's just nice. Asset secure. So so far works on the gatekeeper, all the archon, all the side zombie. I think you're melting. Think gatekeeper, blast him. Because you should know. <laughs> you should know that the lancers, well, controlled enemies don't do anything for you. Shit, Archon. 50% chance to kill. One damage, because you missed. I got nothing. I'm running low on ammo. Incendiary one at the other guy. So now we're burning. Good. 50% chance. Go for it. Darn. Shot wide. Negative. Weapons dry. Which it? Hmm. Go for the sniper rifle, kill them. I definitely got that one. I'm a ghost. Okay, run up. Okay, you're probably gonna get slashed up by this guy. Three more damage. Okay. I think I destroyed the thing on the roof, did I? No. That's affirmative. Got ready to move up. Free reload. Side. Overwatch on him. I guess that'll be okay. Hunker down for the improved All aim. Set. Is still there. I wonder who can see him. On your order. Overwatch. Overwatch. Ah, so it's Razor who can see him. On your order. Go for the super heavy turret, please. Miss the target. Halt position. Just still burning in there. No where he is though. It's now in a battle frenzy. Alright, oh, spotted me. Oh no, that means the turret's gonna hit me. Hurt. 
hurt. Ow. Oh no. He's getting beaten up, <laughs> Razor. You're getting so beaten up. Absolutely. We'll place the charges anyway. Menace one five status confirmed. X four charges are armed. Move to the extraction point for immediate evac. Kill the Archon. Okay, Okay, Mama Bear, move up. Nice easy location for my guys to get to. Strip the armor, destroy the turret. Well, reaction, just destroy it then. You got superior. One now, something. You've been getting a lot of reactions. Good to go. Get all my soldiers nearby. Stepping off. Got it. Moving. On the move. Sure thing. And turn. More of them in. Okay, so they're calling reinforcements, but there's nothing left Menace at the moment. Five, be advised, we've picked up hostile reinforcements inbound on your position. That's cool. Heading out. Because I'm going. Eva. Eva. I'm out of here. Rolling. Evac. Let's go. If you say so. Just in time. Wenn es sein muss. Ich hau ab. I'm on it. Get now. Everyone run away. Poor Get Razor. Out. How long are you gonna be wounded for? One five status confirmed. X four charges detonated. Hey, two soldiers wounded. Oh yeah, because I used their lancer as a, an offensive unit. It was a very successful mission. I think it was the same with most enemies. If you leave them alive, they will hurt you. Which is gatekeeper will quite happily smash your entire team in one go. No, oh, you're only wounded. Excellent top shelf and candy man are both promoted. Superior repeater. 15% chance. Ooh, ooh, nice. With the alien facility destroyed, their efforts to develop the Avatar project will likely suffer a substantial decline, at least for the time being. Excellent work, Commander. Yay. Your soldiers, so top shell. Congratulations on your full promotion to Ultraviolet.
So, fanfire, five pistols, three times at the same target. Um, or so, a powerful chain shot ability for every kill you make with the sci fi for your actions will be refunded. Hmm. Yes, um. Death from above. Actually, I think fanfire with that, um. With that improved pistol. The, the beam pistol and the blue screen rounds, those just tear through robotics. I think Fanfire would actually kill most robots in, well, in one, sh in one turn. Even like the second pod. Serial would be nice. For every kill you make with a sniper rifle, your action will be refunded. I don't seem to get many kills with the sniper rifle. It does a lot of damage. Enemies just don't die in one hit anymore. Yeah, I think fanfire. Make sure to, to rip through certain targets. And go up. Field medic. Being able to heal people is so very handy. Yay! Facility is destroyed. Let's go uncover the other facility. Pursuit of knowledge is a one, but I want to make contact with this facility. All of our available communications capacity. We can't establish any new contacts until we upgrade our systems. Oh, I just put an engineer there. Let's make contact anyway. Local regional contact. Ooh, sol Solace. Fortress, I think, next. I should see if any of the troops have been keeping count on alien kills. Might be a useful recruiting tool. Yeah, so, you gone up a rank again. Shop to Indigo. Very nice. Straight over to the Geoscape. Ooh, new Shadow Project thing will be in a moment. Central, Commander, excellent. My analysis of the fragmented Codex data is almost complete. The information I've uncovered so far outweighs the loss of the Shadow Chamber, as you'll see. Is that an elder? Haven't seen one in at least a decade. Yes, and I believe I now understand why. The elders appear to be afflicted with an aggressive form of tissue degeneration. Rapid muscular atrophy, to a degree I had not even thought possible. So they're dying. Sounds like our job just got a whole lot easier. As with most things involving this adversary, it's never quite that simple. Uh. The elders have been aggressively searching for a cure to their condition for centuries. Each time they encountered a new species, they procured what genetic information and material they required and moved on to the next world. Until now. I believe they found something in us. Something important enough to cause them to take root. A cure? Not that I can determine. Several key files were previously deleted as part of something called the Avatar Directive. Avatar. We need those files. Were I to gain access to a fully functioning codex, I might be able to recover them. Or blow the entire ship to hell this time around. I didn't say I needed the creature here, Bradford. I am confident I could access the unit remotely, provided your soldiers can get close enough to it in the field without destroying it first. That we can arrange, Doctor. Oh, great. So it's a capture of codex. New objective added. So got to use a skull jack on the codex. 
It looks like we've got our work cut out for us, Commander. Yeah. Well, that's an annoyance. It's going to be a real pain <laughs> on that objective. Oh. Uh, yeah. Sometimes I should have really researched this first, had a lot more opportunity. Ah, uh, anyway. With time set aside to further an analyze the data fragments left over from our initial codex experiment, I finally managed to crack their code, and the resulting data is perhaps more valuable, and shocking, than I had expected. I understand now why the codex was willing to sacri sacrifice itself to protect this information. In the shadows, the alien overseers known to us as the Elders have continued to work on our secrets since the very beginning of Advent, although Central Officer Bradford tells me that no one has seen an Elder in the flesh for over a decade. We continue to see monuments in their likeness throughout the city centres. This is because they never left, they simply fell into the shadows, focusing their efforts on a more dire concern. The Elders are dying. Among the diverse and widely varied alien species we've encountered, the Elders are uniquely afflicted by some sort of rapid muscular degeneration. Their physical forms are no longer capable of containing the psionic energy that is the Elders' lifeblood. Just as we've encountered these unique alien species in the field, at some point in the past, the Elders encountered them as well, and used them for an attempt to cure this plague among their own kind. Unfortunately for them, and for us, it seems that they've never found this cure, and now it appears they're looking to use humanity as their next candidate. Intriguing. Though that is actually, um, in XCOM 1, uh, the end... At the end of the game, it basically says the elders are you know, found us. Oh, that's the archive. Um, wait, I need to upgrade you, don't I? Not got enough supplies. Let's continue making contact. Ooh, inspire. Void rift. Explosive field of psionic energy that immediately damages everything within. Ooh, instantly damages. It's not like the other one. That's cool. So you have got a new rank. The, Ill the illustrious pink. Wow. The violet rank. I'm just using pink as a useful differentiating colour. And new targets. Here we got three here. Uh, Sumikrav Novotikov. A load of intel. Counter the event. Yeah, two blocks. I'm, I'm going to have to do this one. Very difficult, but Elite Officer Mech. Yeah, that's going to be the one we're going to have to go for. It's going to be painful. And I've got to try and capture Codex. Yay. Uh, oh well. We'll figure all that out in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching this episode of XCOM 2. I am Anna Diffin, and I shall see you next time for that Gorilla Ops mission. But until then, I'm out. Goodbye.